I'm Vanita Pappas. In today's painting demonstration, I'll be painting some sunflowers, which I set out on my porch on a bright sunny day. The demonstration will show you how to capture that really warm, rich yellow color in watercolor, and also how to do some negative painting, which is where you paint around an area that you've already painted in a previous step. Keeping everything pretty loose at this point, you know, I'm not really worried about painting in um, the flowers exactly how they should look and I'm not worried about painting individual petals and being overly detailed. I'm just trying to get the overall impression of the um, transition of color, keeping it, like I said, the white of the paper at the edge and then transitioning it to more of a richer, darker color as it gets towards the center. And more negative painting. I'm painting in the um, areas between the flowers where you see the porch railing. Um, again, this is kind of a dark neutral color using raw umber. Mostly it's raw umber and cerulean blue. I might pick up a little other color here and there, but that's the foundation for this color. And it is pretty dark. Um, that's one of the aspects of this reference photo is that, or of the subject, I should say, is that the porch railing is pretty dark, which I think will help bring out those bright yellow flowers. This is the point of the painting where everything kind of slows down and I take my time and I'm pretty darn methodical. You know, at the beginning of the painting, everything is kind of loosey-goosey, all in one go, painting wet into wet. And then as I move towards the end of the painting, it's more about looking at the painting, studying it, and seeing what it needs, and asking myself if I can do something to make it stronger without going overboard. You know, I, I want to still maintain that loose feel, but I also need to bring it to a point of refinement. <laughs> 